Of the 24 rooms here at Hammond Castle, this was John Hayes Hammond Jr.'s favorite room because it captures the spirit of medieval France outdoors as if a village had been brought back from Europe and placed here in this spot. This is absolutely amazing. It feels like Europe. It feels like a courtyard of a small town, some quaint village. Absolutely. It's incredible. It's got a church basically as the center of your village with part of his Roman tombstone collection embedded in the front of it and an archway car from lava from Mount Vesuvius which believe it or not, Jeff, he paid $300 for. And it was valued several years ago at almost a quarter of a million. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. But the pool is the, really the focal point of this room, which would have been in medieval times the village's water supply. But this was his swimming pool. It's 30,000 gallons worth of fresh water, and it's eight and a half feet deep. There is no shallow end. And how do you get in the pool? Well, he would dive out of his bedroom window at the far left corner of the room and swim around and start his day about 5.30 in the afternoon. Again, because uh, Alexander Graham Bell told him to work at night. So he would stay in bed during the day when the museum was open and then he'd be up most of the night. And he felt that the pool would, would constantly refresh him. Now, not only does this room have the 30,000 gallon pool, but it's got its own climate system. You can have artificial daylight, you can have artificial sunlight, you can fog the room. He loved to have the room rain. And I've often thought about guests that spent a weekend here, if you were a positive type person, probably rained the entire time you were here. And if you were one of these maudlin kind of pensive people, he would have the sun out in the room for that entire visit. This was his sense of humor. He loved to keep people off guard.